This is London. And so is this. The difference discernible represents a period of about 400 years. Yes, this is London as it was in the year 1600. London Bridge comes into view. The first London Bridge with the heads of executed traitors stuck on poles over its southern gate on the Surrey side. And at its foot, Southwark Cathedral as it stands today. This panorama shows us nearly all the London that was, the part we now call the city. In the dim distance, the Guild Hall and St Mary's Bow are about the only landmarks that are familiar to us. That which we now call the West End was open country and Westminster was still a separate town. That noble edifice on the horizon is St Paul's Church before it was burnt down in the Great Fire. Christopher Wren built on its site the cathedral we now know so well. What are these two odd-looking round buildings with open roofs? They are theatres, or as the Elizabethans called them, playhouses, about the first ever put up in England. How right we are to go on. For this is the famous Globe Playhouse where William Shakespeare himself acted and where his immortal works were first played. And where from here? To another place and still another time, Southampton in the year 1415, King Henry V of England prepares himself for his destiny. Now sits the wind fair. Uncle of Exeter, set free the man committed yesterday that railed against our person. We considered it was the heat of wine that set him on, and on his wiser thought we pardon him. That's mercy, but too much security. Let him be punished, Sovereign. This example breed by his sufferance more of such a kind. Oh, let us yet be merciful. We doubt not now, but every rub is smoothed on our way. Then forth, dear countrymen! Let us deliver our puissance into the hand of God, putting it straight in expedition. Cheer it to see! The signs of war advance! No king of England, if not king of France! France. Princess Catherine, the French king's daughter. Some strangers in the courtyard. The English ambassadors are leaving her father's frightened court. Conscious of her destiny, her eyes linger on the English as they ride back to their king. October the 25th, 1415. The French ride into battle, the Battle of Agincourt.
Robert Newton as Pistol. Leslie Banks as Cora. Rene Asherson as Princess Catherine. Esmond Knight as Flew Ellen. Lawrence Olivia as Henry V. 